Hello everyone, my name is Shuna from grade 6. I'm 11 years old and today I'm going to tell you about being a teacher, one of the most hardest jobs today. Teaching is a rewarding profession that it gives you an opportunity to make an impact on future generations. Being a teacher takes patience, dedication, passion and the ability to do more with less. Teachers have the hardest job because they have to juggle their personal life and school life. They have to mark a ton of books, never getting fit from themselves. Teachers also have to deal with students who are troublemakers. Lots of students keep on talking, never understanding how hard it is for the teacher to keep them quiet. Teachers also make very little money, and a lot of their money goes towards buying supplies for students. Teachers never get vacation. Instead, they use that time to kind of prepare more lessons to teach their students. Many kids might not understand what the teacher is trying to teach. Therefore, the teacher has to spend more hours trying to teach the kid that particular subject. Here, I'm going to expand on some factors that make teaching challenging and hard. 1. Disturbing environment. For students to focus on lessons, teachers have to keep the environment that students can learn. For example, a teacher has to make a, a kid sit in the building and learn. Otherwise, the kid might, might get distracted with what he outside. 2. Finding balance. A teacher can have a lot of things on her mind, like family issues and going on vacation. However, she must still learn how to control these things in front of her kids. 3. In the majority of students. Some students have learning disabilities, so teachers should try help those students and make them feel comfortable and proud of who they are. Teachers should make them realize that they, that they are unique and equal to all. They should not make them feel left out. Four, lack of resources. A teacher needs to do what's best for her own students, even if it means buying buying supplies using her own money. The school might not provide the children pencils, rollers, rubber sharpeners, and the races. So the teacher has to provide the students with all the stationery. Five, varying levels of parental involvement. Most parents expect their kids to be successful in their academics. Some of them may not know how to teach their children. So the teacher will have to look into it more and focus on what's best for kid. Quotes. Before concluding, I would like to present you all some quotes. Teaching is the one profession that creates all other professions. This was written by an unknown person. Teachers give us comic artists, astronauts, architects, and interpreters. Without teachers, we wouldn't have Superman, the Eiffel Tower, or the internet. Ultimately, it is the teachers who have the greatest superpowers, creating superheroes. What the teacher is, is more important than what he or she teaches. This was written by Karl Menlinger. The knowledge shares will always be shaped by who they are and students will always remember how teachers made them feel as they were learning. This next quote is dedicated to my teacher. Dear tired teacher, when the expectations begin to feel impossible, remember, because of you, someone smiled, made a connection, became more confident and felt loved. Conclusion. Teaching may be hard, but in the end, our teachers do so much for our well-being, health and education. So if you see your teacher walking, walking in the door, make sure to give them a great big smile and tell them how much you appreciate them teaching. Thank you to my teachers as well who support me every single day. Teachers are amazing and are so great. Thank you. And thank you for the people who gave me this opportunity.